Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Sex Tech. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to delete corrupted data on your PS5. So first, you have to figure out whether the game is a PS5 game or a PS4 game by simply looking at the icon next to the application. So Minecraft is a PS4 game on the PlayStation 5. Then we want to go up to settings right here and select this. And then scroll on down to where it says save data in game app settings. Then choose whether it's PS5 or PS4 and then go on over to console storage. On the top here, we want to go over to delete, and it's going to say, please wait. Then locate the game you want to go ahead and delete the corrupted data for. So let's go to where it says Trackmania, and then go to delete. And we can completely delete this off our PlayStation 5. Then I'm going to go to OK right here and press yes. Then we want to back out. Now we want to go to where it says cloud storage, and you can download the saved data from the cloud. Now this is only for PlayStation Plus subscribers. So if you do not have PlayStation Plus, do not do the first or second step. You want to go ahead, go to the third step. So under here now, we want to try to download the console storage. So let's locate that game and then select it and then go to download it and get it back on our PlayStation 5. Now if you do not have PlayStation Plus and you don't want to go ahead and try deleting the information off your PlayStation, hold down the PlayStation button and tap it and then go on over to power and then go to turn off. Then find a USB cable and plug it into the front slot of your PS5. And then plug the other end into your controller. And wait for it to completely turn off. Right here you need it turned off to enter rest mode. So there's no light blinking anymore. Now hold down the power button. You'll hear one beep initially and then about 5 to 10 seconds later you will hear a second beep. Once you hear that second beep you can go ahead and let go. Go to your controller. Press the PlayStation button now. And you should be able to operate the safe mode menu with D-pad and select with X. Now under here, you can go to option number three, repair console storage. You can try that out. If that doesn't work, you can go down to option number six, rebuild database. Once you're in this menu, go back to rebuild database. It says it may take a few hours to do this, but in my experience, it only takes about five to ten minutes. This should repair any kind of corrupted data you have on your PlayStation 5. But hopefully this video did indeed help you out did leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more tech help videos coming up next time your six studios